Folks, it's Colin here again from Salt Marine. Delighted today to be able to show you this fantastic 2020. This one's the Ford Fiesta Active. It's the Active Edition. It's finished in uh, race red. It's just done 23,000 miles. It's had one private owner from new. We sold the car and it's absolutely spotless as you can see here. It's the Fiesta with the chunkier look and the higher seating position, which a lot of people love. And let me show you some of the features. Really, really well equipped this car. It has the 17 inch factory alloy wheels, all of which as you can see there are totally unmarked. I'll show you each one of them in a moment. It has the LED, if I just flick the button on here, it has the LED running lights, you can see, LED rear lights, front fog lights, the satin chrome uh, front and rear bumper trims, and that runs along the sills here too. And as you can see there, it has the wheel arch extensions for that chunkier look as well. Bodywork on the car, as you can see, is absolutely exceptional. There's no scrapes or scratches, and I'll show you right around the car here. It has privacy glass as well, uh, factory and uh, black roof rails, and the rear spoiler there too. Park Pilot as well on the car, which is the rear sensors, but also the little diagram of the car on the screen, and we'll show you that too. see the boot is really good and deep and just look how clean it is absolutely spotless split folding rear seats if you need that bit of extra room there and just look at the top of the rear bumper there with me great to see no scrapes scratches or marks either which is great again just a view of the passenger side there too just to let you see how dent and scrape free the car is really really well looked after and the seating is the same absolutely spotless it's never been smoked in has the silver stitching as you can see here two-tone trim even has factory mats in the car from new as well so now here on the sill protectors you've even got a little film of cover from when the car left the factory so they've never been removed and you can see just how good those seats are as well there absolutely flawless leather steering wheel as well and that touchscreen information center and then that gloss black um, panther black trim on the interior of the car as well six-speed gearbox too so exceptionally easy on fuel as well Have a look along the front of the car too. No stone chips there either. So we'll go inside then and show you some of those interior features too. Electric windows all round, electric power folding mirrors too. Automatic lights, again the sill protector is still on there from when the car was new. And as I say, factory mats in the car as well. Has the LED uh, cup holder lights too. And I'm just going to show you the park pilot system here. Um, so we're just engaging reverse and going back here now. And you can see there, as well as the sensors, you have the diagram of the car. These are green, orange and red the closer you get to the object behind you, which is great. Down here then you have a range of driving mode options and they are uh, normal, eco, sport mode, one for driving in slippery conditions and one for driving in muddy conditions as well. And you can see it turns the traction control off there as well. We'll just go back into normal. But those do work if you're driving in slippy conditions or muddy conditions. Change the driving mode and it really does help the traction to get to your destination safely. Super, super uh, feature there on the Fords. This is the uh, heating system here. Very, very easy to use, air conditioning if you want it on. But this also, uh, unique to the Ford range, is the heated front screen. So if you come out of the house in the morning, 
forget that it's frosty, get into the car and the window's frozen, hit the button here, and that will defrost the front window, uh, just like the heated rear window that we're all used to. The front screen's heated in this car too, so. This then is the touchscreen information center, and on this, you've got all your digital radio channels, you've got Bluetooth for your phone, which we can pair up for you, factory satellite navigation, and then if we scroll across, you have Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto on this car as well. And again, we can go through all that with you and uh, make sure that you're happy with that and how it all works. Uh, volume controls for the stereo then you have here. You have your cruise control and your speed limiter here as well. And then this one here will seek out the radio stations and will also do voice activation for the Bluetooth. So when we pair your phone up, you can hit this button and tell it who you want to phone and it'll do that for you as well, which is great. You'll not have to scroll through any menu. This one here then, let me show you just, it'll give you your MPG and all that useful information. But also, if we scroll down, you can get a digital speedometer reading. Scroll down again. This is your driver assist. When you get to this, you hit this little button here beside it and that tells you what you've got. So you have lane keep assist, hill start assist, and rear park pilot that we spoke about earlier there. And then you can go into your navigation on this as well. You can go into your digital radio channels and you can scroll through the menu on your Bluetooth and then back to the main menu again. All along the interior trim, you remember you have your leather center armrest, your leather gear, or your parking brake, leather gear knob here as well. The steering wheel's leather too, but just all along those interior parts of the trim on the car are just as the car left the factory. They're absolutely spotless there, you can see. So, as I said, just 23,000 miles on this one. It's 2020. It's the Fiesta Active Edition. It's finished in race red. It's had one private owner and the car's absolutely spotless. Just in the showroom today, I'm Colin and my colleague Mark here. We'll be delighted to show it to you. No, you'll be impressed with it and uh, hopefully you've had a look at the video and it's been informative for you and you know where we are we're just 20 minutes from spruce field at junction 14 on the m1 motorway so really easy to find as well and thanks for taking the time to watch the video